I'm Jory from Utah, and we're gonna talk about how to reattach loose cabinets. So first off, we need to kind of understand how it, how it is wiggling. If our cabinet's loose, if it's loose side to side, this one looks like it's pretty good side to side, but as you can see front to back, it's definitely jiggly, which means that it's not screwed all the way to the wall. So first thing is to find the studs. We have to know where our studs are at. If you do not have a stud finder uh, and you don't want to put holes in your wall, go purchase a stud finder. If you are, don't think that's that big of a deal and you're not that worried about it, you can just get a nail and a hammer and just kind of hammer across just on your sheetrock, either below or above your cabinet, and just kind of hammer through until you find a stud. You can also knock on the, you can also knock to kind of have an idea of where, of where the studs are at. The more solid sound lets you know that there's a stud, a stud there. I previously have found the studs in this one, so I kind of know where they're at. So. After we have that idea, we're gonna screw the cabinet back into the wall here, which allows the cabinet to be firm. So you can see it's no longer jiggling, and it's also good side to side. So then the next thing I'll do is just check the level. Sometimes after my cabinets have been loose, we're gonna check the level and make sure that it's still, that it's still sitting the way it should be. Like that. And then we can reattach our doors and put our stuff back in there. I'm Jory from Utah, and we've just talked about how to reattach loose cabinets.